सब्सक्राइब एंड क्लिक द बेल आइकन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू मेक दिस प्रोजेक्ट कैट जंपिंग ऑन द ट्रेन एंड आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ इट वर्क्स द कैट विल बी ऑन द ट्रेन एंड वी शुड यूज द स्पेस टू jump it should not touch the birds flying here when it touch it will show game over and let's make it you can use the sprite or this one if you are using this one it should have these three costumes i am going to use this one so i am going to delete this one Keep a green flag option here. Before that, paint a sprite and take the square and change its color to red and draw it fully here, like this. Then change the square's color to blue and. Draw squares here for the window, like this. Then take a circle, change its color to black, and put two wheels here for the wheels. then go to backdrop and take this square and then change its color to blue and it should be fully here then choose black and then draw a black square here as the track for the train also draw a sun so take this circle and change its color to yellow and draw it here then go to code and then choose a sprite and type here tree take this and keep it here keep it here it should not touch the edge then let's do coding for the tree keep a green flag option and then keep a go to block keep it in the position you want it should be here and then keep the block then go to control and take this forever and keep it here then take an if block and keep it here then go to sensing and take this touch touching mouse pointer change it to edge then go to motion and take this move 10 steps change it to minus 5 And when it touches the edge, it should come back to this position. So remove these blocks and then duplicate this go to block, and then keep it inside here and see whether it's working like this. It's going, and when it touches the edge, it's coming again. If you want, you can duplicate this, but both are coming together. So go to the other. and then then go to looks and then first keep high then go to control and keep a weight block here then go to looks and scroll down and take this show and then it will come like this And also one thing 
Take this go to front layer and keep it here. Change it to ba back and same way here also. Now it's not at the front. Now let's do coding for the train. Just keep the train at the position you want here. This. Then in the train, just keep a green flag option and then take a go to block and keep it here. Now let's do coding for the cat. If you're using this one, we need to use this this block. If you're using the other one, we don't you don't need this block. So go to control and take this. Before that, put the cat in the position you want. I'll keep it here. And then go to motion and keep this. Go to and keep it here. Then then take a if else block from here then go to sensing and take this touching color and keep it here and choose this red color of the train then go to motion and then take this change y change y by 10 and keep it here here in the else block and change it by minus 5 and then it should change to its normal costume this one like this so so go to looks and then take this change costume and then take this costume this costume is this one it should be here it should not be here it should be here then then take this and keep it here and see which one take it should be this one when it's falling and it's already like that so when it's falling it's like that then take another if else block and take this full and keep it inside this else the full if else block in the else condition here then Take a, take a key space pressed in sensing this one and keep it here and it should be space only not other one inside go to looks and then it should be this one then keep this and change it to that and also keep change y by 5 so when we click on the space it's going up and when it's falling it's changing to a correct costume next we have next take a bird and choose a sprite go to animals and scroll scroll down and take a parrot change its size to 50 not 50 30 this is okay and go to its costume and then take this and click on this one then this will point towards this direction like this do it for the other costume also then go to code and then keep this bird here and then take this and keep it here then take a 
forever block and keep it here then an F block then go to motion and take this go to block and keep it here then then go to sensing and take this touching block and keep it here and choose uh, keep it to edge then then go to motion and then take this move minus 5 steps and inside keep this one this two should be same and see whether it's working like this but the bird doesn't look like it's flying so so just take a another green flag option then take a forever block and keep a weight block in here and then take this change next costume and keep it here then, then it's changing its costume like this but when we touch that bird it's it's not it's not game over the game over is not coming it should not this is not the way how the code should not be like this because the if it's like this the bird will go only here then the game will be easy so take this change this one, this one and keep it here and then just delete this and then take this go to random and keep it here then it will be like this not not this one this x and now it's changing its position and going this should not be there so delete this and then remove this and duplicate this and then keep it here and now we can just go randomly like this now in the cat take a green flag option and then scroll down and take a forever block and then if block inside the forever block then if it touch the parrot if it touch the parrot it should show game over so go to events and then take this broadcast message and click on new message and type game over and click on ok then take a then paint a sprite just take a square and change its color to red and keep it fully here like this then take this text and then type game over it the text is also in red color so change it to black and then type game over and then make it big like this and keep it in the middle here then keep it in keep it in the position and then then go to motion and take this and set the position to zero here and zero here and then go to events and take this and keep it here first it should hide hide then go to looks and then keep this hide block and keep it here and show and stop all here like that take this game over and keep it here and then scroll down and then take this stop ball and see whether it's working when it touch it's showing game over if you want you can duplicate this and that's it thanks for watching if you like this video please
subscribe and click the bell icon.